Okay, guys, welcome back to another Paranormal Moment with Kitsy, brought to you by ParanormalXRoad.com, where we are working to bring peace to people living with paranormal activity. So, what am I holding on to? Some of you may find this a creepy doll. I don't. This is my dear sweet Annette. Um, for those of you that don't know, I collect a couple haunted dolls. So um, I found a Facebook group at one point and they were selling haunted dolls and I bid on this one and I got her. So here she is and probably not often enough if you ask her, but I do sessions with her. Sometimes it's a spirit box session. Sometimes it's a ITC app session. Sometimes it's dowsing rods. Today I'm going to try the uh, pendulum I have right here. So how this works is the pendulum is you hold it as still as you can. And if there's a, a spirit that's willing to talk to you, at least in my house, when it goes around in a circle like it is right now, that's a yes answer. Similar to when the dowsing rods crossover into an X on the show. So, and then if it swings back and forth, can I, can I get you to do that? Can you go back and forth for a no answer for them? Is that going to be your no? I'm really feeling pins and needles in my pinky right now. Can you make it swing back and forth as opposed to in a circle for me, Annette? There we go, just a little bit of side to side action. So is that gonna be your no? Can we make that your no? Okay. So Annette, go ahead and answer some yes or no questions for my friends that are watching this right now. Can you tell them if you are a girl with a yes or a no signal? Are you a girl? I constantly watch my hand as I'm doing this because I'm so worried that it's actual, actually subconscious. Um, can you make that a little bigger, little bigger circle for me, Annette? And I literally just stare at my hand to make sure I'm not doing it. A little bigger, baby, a little bigger. Oh, look at you. Look at you. There we go. There we go. A little bigger. Oh, yeah. There it is, girl. Good job. So we know that you're a little girl. And let's stop it. Can you tell us yes or no if you lived in the Midwest of the United States? Yes or no? There we go, a little bigger so they can see it on the video, baby. Good job, great job, look at that, look at that. Good job, way to go, good job, way to go. Okay, so can you tell us yes or no, you know what the, the signs are, if you were under the age of 10? Oh, we've got to know. I believe when I bought her, they told me she was six. That's interesting. Okay, we're going to stop it. Okay, darling baby girl, are you under the age of 15? Yes or no? There it goes. Little bigger, little bigger girl. Keep it going. Little bigger. Oh, there she goes. There she goes. Good job. Good job. Okay. There we go. So, 
I don't know, number 13 just popped into my head. Are you 13 years old? No, right away. No, okay, are you 11 years old? Still no. Are you 10? No. Are you 13? I already said that. Are you 14? Oh, there it goes. There, you're 14 years old. Okay. Good job. A little bigger. A little bigger circle. A little bigger. Great job. Look at that. That's so cool. Okay. Just rest my arm for a second. Look at the good you do. Great job. Okay. Annette, do you remember passing away? Yes or no? Yes. Okay. Well, I'm sorry about that. Is it a sad memory for you? Oh, wow. There she goes. There she goes. Okay, well, I'm sorry. Did you get hurt when you died? If that's a yes, make it go a little faster for me. A little faster if it's a yes. If it's a no, you know what to do. Yeah. Okay. Do you not want to talk about how you died? I'm going to say that's a no. Okay. Um, let's see. Did you have a choice between heaven and staying on earth after you died? Okay. And that's picking up speed rather fast. Okay. And you chose to have your spirit put in this doll, correct? That's what they told me when I bought her. And that's pretty big. Oh, wow. Okay. Are you happy here? Yeah. Do you like the puppies? Yeah. Even though they like to chew on your shoes sometimes. Oh yeah. Well, I'm happy you're happy. Are there other spirits here with you, Annette? Even though it's getting too high, my thumbs, the chain's actually hitting my thumb. Are there other spirits here in the house with you, Annette? Yes. Wow. Is there, including you, are there two spirits here? Are there more than two spirits here? I'm sorry. Oh, she was going to know. Now she's going back to a circle. Good job. You're really, really good at this. Is there more than three spirits here? Yes. Okay. Is there more than four spirits here? I'm only aware of four. Is there five? Yes. Does that include my dad? Okay. Cool. And he's only here sometimes, right? He's got checking on my sisters and my brother, right? Yes, he does. Okay. Good job. Good job. Now, are you friends with all the spirits that are here? Everybody gets along really well? 
Yeah. So you, are you saying that you don't want to leave here? Oh, it is getting all kinds of wonky. No. Well, you got to make it go side to side so I know it's a no. There she goes. So I know it's a no. Okay. Okay. Well, good. I'm happy you're happy here. This is a much longer video than I thought it was going to be, but this is what a pendulum session is like when I talk to my dolls. This is Annette. She, my backstory on her is yes, she was from the Midwest. She died in a farming accident, um, but she's happy to be here with my resident spirits that I brought home and my other haunted doll who is Claudette and my dad who pops in from time to time. So we've got Anna, we've got Abby, we've got Annette, Claudette, and dad. There we go. Thank you. Oh, sh she's telling me something. Oh, she wants me to tell you to help us bring peace to actual people experiencing paranormal activity. Kickstart our show now at ParanormalXRoad.com. Thanks, guys. Don't forget, if you sweeten the pot today, you'll get a great big thank you and a squee this Thursday at 7 p.m. live on Facebook. Thank you.